Playing the two concertos in one concert, uh, I think, is actually a wonderful thing to do because you get to compare both these works. Um, the concerto number one is the earlier work. Um, it's very youthful, very light, uh, very fresh. It contrasts somewhat with the concerto number two, which is more mature in a sense, um, has more of a singing quality to it, uh, long lines, and is also harmonically uh, a little more romantic already. Um, so it's wonderful to put one uh, next to the other. The two events that we had um, where I got the chance to interact with the audience here were very interesting for me and very enjoyable also. And what I found remarkable, especially in the first event, was that people came up with very intelligent and very interesting questions um, that showed uh, a great understanding actually of, of what music making is all about in this whole creative process that, that we go through. That's a very good question. Um, and the other wonderful thing to see for me was that people really get excited by classical music and it's something that they can enjoy and they can relate to and it really speaks to the universal the nature of, of music. Cello, that's nice. Do you like it? Yes. You have a smaller cello than me though. Yeah. yeah I <laughs> For me the rehearsals were lots of fun and I felt that there was a great energy in the rehearsals. The sound they make is wonderful and there's a true sense of music making here which uh, is wonderful for me.